Most people are familiar with the three P's that I've been talking about for a long time through the propensity of my online and offline work. Across all my social media networks and across this YouTube channel, I talk about the three P's of life. The three P's of life are personhood, our human dignity underneath the law, our paperwork, our legal documentation and record, records that regard our whole life and impact our life, and our possessions or our property which are the things that we possess, we own, we purchase, we paid for, or received as presents. When I'm talking about these things, I'm really talking today, however, about records abuse. Records abuse is a form of litigation abuse. These are the people who like to play in communities, who like to lie, steal, and cheat people like me out of healthy records in our environment. Our records apply to every aspect of our life, from life to death. A record abuser will try to abuse someone's birth record, steal it, take it, ruin it, destroy it, delete it, use it for themselves, and the lie. A records abuser will call police on someone who's doing absolutely nothing wrong to create countless records of someone they just want to push off their block. That is a form of records abuse. It is technically called litigation abuse. When police officers are constantly pouncing, constantly stalking, constantly mobbing someone to create unlawful records, it is a form of litigation abuse, a part of gaslighting, a part of mobbing, which are both treacherous and treasonous acts against the federal government who at the end of the day they report to who the federal president of america liars in america are often the liars on everything people who steal will often blame the victim and call police on them so they can try to get out of the shit they've pulled liars in america who hack our computers will often call police on someone so they can distract from the fact that they're abusing the law